What's up, I'm Ujem and welcome back to my channel. Today, I wanted to talk about a really popular uh, conversation that's happening right now in the dev community. So there's been a lot of talks to change the Git's master branch naming convention over to something that's a lot more inclusive, like calling it main branch. There have been a lot of other suggested names like primary or root, but main has been the one that's been sticking the most recently. And before we get into all of this, I want to hear your initial thoughts on this topic, even if this is the first time you've heard about it or you've probably might have done a lot of research on the topic, I want to hear your thoughts, so please leave them down in the comment section below. This push has been around for a couple of years. The first time that I probably heard about wanting to change the master branch over to main was probably a year ago. But the reason why it's become such a popular talking point again and a lot of people are talking about it is because this past Friday, GitHub actually announced that they had plans in the works to change the default branch naming convention over from master to something that's a lot more inclusive. The first time that I heard about this argument, I could already hear the tech bros being like, this isn't what we want, we shouldn't have to be changing branches, da 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 And even beyond that, there have been a lot of conversations coming from both sides of the tables for people who are for the change and who are against the change. And I wanted to make this video to kind of put my two cents in this whole conversation that's happening right now on the internet. So if you're not too familiar with the pro-change and anti-change arguments, I'll try my best to generalize what I've seen on the internet, but I highly recommend that you take your own time and read up on these arguments so you're well informed about what this change is actually gonna do to the tech community. So the most common argument that I've seen online for changing master over to main has been that people want to reduce the number of references to slavery terminology or just problematic terminology. And the push to change master over to main is just one of many initiatives to reduce the number of problematic language that's like inside the world of code. For example, a really common push that people want to uh, include is removing blacklist and whitelist terminology for something that's not related to color. So it's just trying to make a more inclusive space for black people in the tech industry. That's like the, the overarching argument for changing master domain. So for the anti-change arguments, I've seen a ton that have all been half-baked. But what I can pick up from these arguments is that um, changing master domain is changing a standard. There's no need to change something that is just so ingrained into the way that people are developing code every single day. It will break a lot of code. Um, also, it will just be annoying to have to explain to people why we are no longer using the term master and we're using probably like main, root, primary, or any other term out there. And I've also seen arguments saying that the Git um, master terminology doesn't actually refer to slavery terminology. A lot of people are saying it's pretty similar to the way that we use like, like a master's degree or something like that. And um, to all those arguments that I've heard and the many more that have come up on the internet, you can find so many more arguments online. I just feel like they're really half-baked and a really weak attempt to push back on something that doesn't really need so much energy. You, know, you don't have to spend so much energy pushing back on changing branch names. There's a lot more that we can be fighting and arguing about, but we're arguing about Get branches. So the point of this video isn't for me to nitpick at all the arguments that I disagree with. The general vibe that I have for those arguments is that I just disagree with them. But instead, I want to just share my opinion and provide a lot more perspective and nuance to what's going on um, in this grand conversation as a person of color, as a black woman um, in tech. So my opinion, I support the change. I'm for changing master over domain but not because I felt like I was being targeted or othered because we were using the master terminology. Honestly, whenever I saw the term master in GitHub or GitLab or any other service out there, I just thought of it as more of like a master copy of our repository. Like it's the final version that um, everyone would be using. So there was like no point where I'd see the term master and just automatically start feeling a little bit uncomfortable. It was just a term that I normalized, everyone else has normalized, and we just like kept using. So my support doesn't come from actively wanting to change it, but because a lot of people are talking about it and there are people of color and a lot of other people who are uncomfortable with the term, we should just change it. So if I'm not actively supporting this change, I wanna clarify what I am supporting and I'm supporting the general idea, which I think is kind of like embodied in this change, but I'm supporting the general idea of supporting and helping black people 
in tech. And changing GitHub branch names from master to main is not going to directly help Black people, but I am in support of the idea that allies and people of color, and specifically Black people, are trying to bring awareness to the idea that Black software engineers, Black leaders, just Black people in general in tech have it significantly harder than every single other person. So I don't want to get caught up with like the details of like what the right way and the wrong way of helping Black people is, especially with a change that's not going to hurt us in the long run. But my main concern with this change, though, is that a lot of people are going to kind of wipe their hands once we do migrate over from master domain. It kind of gives me the same vibe that people had back in like 2008 when Barack Obama became president and people were like, oh, yeah. Racism is done because we have a black president now. I feel like this change from master over to main is such an easy, temporary, or I want to say more of just like a really quick solution that will have long lasting effects. Everyone's going to remember Barack Obama as the first black president for the rest of United States' history. And we're going to remember the change from master over to main because every single new repository is going to be using the new like default branch name. But I really am worried about the idea that people will see this moment in time where we changed branch names and they thought like this was the most that we had to do. We put so much energy into it, we fought so hard, we supported black people, like we basically ended discrimination for black people. And I know there's not going to be people who are really going to think like 100% of racism is going to be gone, but I'm really worried that people are going to look back at that moment and kind of just say like that was a bulk of the work. I feel like there's a lot of opportunities for performative allyship during this time where a lot of people are just jumping on the bandwagon of signing RFCs or documents and supporting something that is really hands off to them. Chances are you're not probably going to have to change these like branch names over. But I think there's a lot of people who can just like identify this as a moment in time where they'll be on the right side of history and they'll just say, yeah, I support it when they're not actively supporting the idea of supporting black people in tech. It's a nice gesture as a person of color. I really do appreciate allies trying to help, but this isn't, this isn't the way to go. This isn't where you want to be spending a lot of your energy. You want to be spending your energy in programs and initiatives that will get more black people at your company. If you're going to take anything away from this video, just take this one thing. The one thing that black people want in tech companies is diversity and equity, truly being seen and heard and treated like everyone else, properly being valued like everyone else. So changing the master branch over to main is a great gesture, but it's not going to increase diversity and equity in tech companies. If you really are about being proper allies and supporting your black coworkers, make sure that you're a part of the process of creating initiatives revamping interviews, talking to your black colleagues, and understanding the whole idea of increasing diversity, not just at the lower levels, not just at junior or senior like software engineers. You want to get black people in leadership roles all the way up the chain throughout the entire company. At every step, you should be able to see a black person. That's the goal. And it's just not a numbers thing. You need to be able to, of course, get every single level of a company filled with black people, but you want to be able that there's a sense of community for those people and you should be valuing their opinions. You can hire like lead of engineering, I don't know, engineering head of your company, but they're out within the next three months because they felt like they weren't being properly valued, you failed. You first, you can, you can get black people. There's no pipeline problem. You can find any qualified black person, but if you can't retain them, if you can't keep them, then you're not succeeding. So going back to the topic of master main, I support it passively. I'll sign off on any like document that's for changing it at any like projects that I'm working on. Honestly, I really couldn't care less if we make the change or if we don't make the change. It doesn't really like, it doesn't really bother me either way. But what I'm really supporting through this change is the idea of constantly supporting and listening to and valuing Black people. Please, if you're working on any project at any company, at just like in any organization that's considering this change, don't be the person to shoot it down, but be the person to really think critically about what this change represents and manifesting that representation properly so Black people actually feel like seen and heard, represented, in their companies. Those are my thoughts. If you guys have any comments and any additions, or you have any thoughts of your own, please leave them down in the comment section below. I want to hear what people think about this. I think there's been a lot of different perspectives that you can take on this conversation, so 
um, leave all your thoughts down below. If you liked the video, please like and subscribe to the channel for more content. You can also find me on Twitter where I've been talking about this for a minute. I also just have general random tweets. And with that being said, I will see you guys in the next one.